Hi everyone, it's Luis again. Uh, listen, today we're gonna do a video on black rot. And black rot is a common um, thing that happens to orchids. Uh, you're gonna encounter it and uh, it's something you can't really get rid of, but you can treat plants as you encounter it or you can uh, spray fungicide to maintain uh, or keep it under control. Now, here's the names of the two funguses or fungi that uh, cause black rot. The first one is Pythium, and the other one is uh, Phytothora. So if you guys wanna look those up, uh, they cause damage to your orchids. Now I'm gonna point out, I have three plants here to show you uh, what happens. On this plant, you're gonna see that the main lead right here has started turning black. And if you compare this pseudobulb right next to this one, you can see that there's uh, a difference in coloration. This pseudobulb has turning a uh, brown compared to this one that's fully green. I'm gonna show you uh, another example on this one right here. This one right here, you can see the new shoot right here, this black rot, it affects the new shoots. Uh, once it gets into the plant, it is hard to kill it. Uh, what is recommended is that you cut the suitable to keep it from progressing and killing your plant. Now, how do you get this? Uh, black rot uh, is usually caused um, during periods of heavy rain, um, when the nights are cool, and especially if you have your plants and uh, if you water them close to plants that have soil, uh, more than likely you're gonna get it. Because what happens, the black rot fungi, they live in soil. So if you have your orchids next to plants that have soil, the spores are gonna jump over and they're gonna invade your plant. So, I have another example here. And on this one, it has, it's pretty bad. So it's not a good thing, but it's a good thing that I'm, I'm able to have it here so that I could uh, tell you about it. Now, if you can see this sort of bulb, the new shoot has died, and then it's progressing to this pseudo bulb, and then now to this one, and this one's already wilting. And then uh, this one, if you touch it, 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 it feels squishy. So what you wanna do is cut the pseudobulb to prevent the plant from dying. So I'm only gonna do it on one but you, you'll get the idea of how to do it at home. Use sterile cutters. And that's what I'm gonna do is take it out of this basket so that I can access it and, uh, and cut that suitable. Now my recommendation is that if you grow orchids outside it's better to keep them between two and a half to three feet off the ground if you have bare ground. If you have concrete or some kind of concrete slab, they'll do okay, but you have to, I would recommend you drench the area with fungicide. Now on this one, I really didn't want to do any damage to it, but it seems I'm gonna have to. So,
here we go. So with the cutters, I'm going to go one, two, three, four pseudo bulbs. And this other one, this one right here is still green and healthy. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut right behind that so that I keep the fungus from growing back. So I will cut right here. Ta -da. There you go. So see I cut it right there and you can see all of this it needs to be taken off. Right there. So, that thing's too bright. Okay, here. This is all the black rot affected part of the orchid. You cut it because it's going to progress backwards into your healthy pseudobulbs and kill your plant. So, it doesn't look like he has invaded the green one. I don't think it has. So what you want to do is apply fungicide. Fungicide, you spray your plant and this you throw away because you don't want it around otherwise it's going to infect your other plants. So. That's my video on black rot. And just to recap, black rot is a taxi orchids. It is caused by Pythium and Phytophthora. And you get it from getting splash rainwater from potted plants from the environment. And if your plants are too low to the ground, I recommend you raise them at least two and a half to three feet off the ground. Uh, and there you go, you cut it so that it doesn't progress backwards. You apply fungicide and you monitor your plant to make sure that it doesn't come back. So that's my video on black rot. I hope you enjoy it.